Hi, this is Kevin, and this is the last video about adjective clauses. I'm going to talk about using whose, and that's chart 12.7 on page 336 in your textbook. So you can check there for another example. So whose is pretty easy, all right? Um, this is talking about possession or possessive pronouns. Don't worry, you don't need to remember those words. Uh, it's not important. But take a look at this example. I think you will understand. J. The woman called the police. Her car was stolen. Oh no. So in this sentence here, I bolded her car. Her is talking about the woman, right? And her car, this is showing possession. She owns the car. So because this is referring to the woman, then we can turn this sentence into an adjective clause and put it here right after the woman. So here we go. K, the woman whose car was stolen called the police. So we just literally take this uh, little phrase here, her car becomes whose car, whose shows this possession. Okay, so you just change that. Her car becomes whose car. The woman whose car was stolen called the police. Okay, one more example. Whose is pretty easy because uh, it's always the same. It doesn't whose doesn't change. So here, the family was friendly. We bought their house. So now we have their. So we just take that phrase their house and change it to whose house. So the family whose house we bought was friendly. Okay. It's very simple like that. Just use whose for possession. Okay, and I'll stop here. You have one or two activities in the textbook to practice that. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you and goodbye.